It's 714 on this Friday morning. As I often do with guests right before we're coming out of commercial break, I went to give you a high five, Jen Banks. Like, let's nail this. Let's do a great segment. You said, I wish I high fived. I just don't. And you won't. But here's the thing. As the host of the show, I can't be left hanging on set. I'm sorry. So I guess the interview can't go any further. Well, I guess Will you pound it out? Yeah, okay. It's even on my Twitter bio, Ryan. I know. I know. I just wanted to break. I wanted to see if you would break on the pressure of live TV, and you won't. And that's because you're a woman of conviction, it's and this is true. how you're known. Welcome back. Jen, you've been here in a number of contexts. Of course, you're a blogger yes. at techmummy.ca. You're yes. all over Twitter. Yes. But uh, I think probably the reason why most Edmontonians have come to see you as a purveyor of good feelings and good vibes is because of this Make Jen's Day movement that you kicked off, what, about a year ago? Exactly a year ago. Okay, so makejensday.com is where you can learn more. What's the basic premise here? So the, what happened last year is that um, Mark Sherrington, who's a youth advocate here in Edmonton, he tweeted out that he needed uh, somewhere for a three-week-old baby to sleep. Mm. And I ended up giving him my youngest baby's bassinet. Um, and he came, picked it up, and as he was leaving, I kind of just broke down and, and, you know, decided that I needed to do something. Um, is this because you realized that, that you had this bassinet, you weren't using it, you, you didn't think to pay it forward until someone asked for it and then you realized, oh my gosh, I had the tools to make someone's day here? Oh, for sure. Plus, um, you know, I, I grew up poor and uh, a lot of people helped me out. So it was just kind of one of those things of um, how can I use, um, I guess, kind of the like social media prowess and the, the ability that I have to connect with a whole bunch of people um, to help people in my community. And this is what Twitter and blogs and Facebook and everything else allows people to do now is uh, you could have stopped right there. You could have made right. somebody's day. You could have provided this bassinet. The, the three-week-old baby has a place to stay. But instead, you, you put this website together, makegensday.com. And now you've got more than 600 documented stories, so there could be twice or three times as many, yeah. of people letting you know about how you've inspired them to complete Random Acts of Kindness. Yeah, I'm just kind of a catalyst. So I think Random Acts of Kindness are awesome because they don't cost a lot of money, they make a huge impact, and you can do them every day. I heard about a cross-country adventure that you yes. inspired. Um, my friend Brenda, who's also my amazing day home lady, um, she was in Ontario driving back um, on the Make Gen's Day weekend last year, and she ended up stopping in every province on the way back to Alberta. And her daughter, she has three little girls, each one of them went into a grocery store and um, got food that they loved and donated it to the local food bank in each city. Absolutely And then amazing. when they got back to Edmonton, they brought flowers to uh, an old folks home. Amazing. Yeah. So it's Make Jen's Day weekend this weekend. It is. Uh, now coming up today, and you're not, you know, you're annoying me in a fun way. Because <laughs> you're not giving me any details. <laughs> Even no. off the record in the commercial break, I'm like, tell me what's going on today. She's like, I'm not telling you. So between 3 to 7 p.m., yes. uh, you're looking for volunteers to come show up to Beaver Hills Park. That's on Jasper and 107th, right? Uh, right by Audrey's 105? Books. 105? Okay, 105? right by Audrey's yeah. Books. You know the park. Uh, you need people to show up between 3 and 7. Yes. And what are you telling them besides that? Nothing. <laughs> okay, so if you want a chance to make someone's day, right, show yeah. up between 3 and 7? Yeah, or you can go to the website and volunteer because you can take part on Saturday or Sunday. I love this, in That's a way. Good. I'm hungry for details and you won't provide them. No, it's I Make will Jen's not. Day weekend. You can find out more details on what she's doing at makejensday.com. Uh, Jen, we're so proud of you and Thank you've you. actually inspired us to do something I here. Did. Uh, yeah, well, because we thought, you know what? I mean, we're not going to sit here and tell all of our friends at home how they can make someone's day without making someone's day ourselves. Okay. So when you come with me, I yes. want to introduce you to somebody. Okay. And she makes everybody's day each and every day. Okay. Uh, and her name, she's not expecting this and okay. so she's probably going to kill us. Okay. But uh, Linda Holmes. Hope is a receptionist here at oh, City and okay. every time that somebody comes here to pick up a prize see here's the deal she yeah. thinks she's answering a call but we're having people call to make sure she stays here at the switchboard yeah see there's nobody on the phone <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, you're running around making people's days bringing people coffee putting oh, out candy oh, you guys. Did you, this is Jen Banks hi this is Linda Hope we've met before you gave my daughter lots of candy I did. right yes, I did. this is what she does Linda you're, an, you're a huge ambassador for City and for breakfast television if you show up here to pick up a prize or come say hi to us linda's the first face you see and so we wanted to recognize make jen's day weekend by hopefully you making your day you. and in a roundabout way making your day yes 
Warm yeah, fuzzies all around. Nothing more than that. We love you, Linda. Oh, thank you. Hey, Jen, you. Yes. put her there. No. I know you won't. <laughs> Great to see you. Thank you for inspiring an entire city. Yes. MakeJensDay.com. It's Make Jen's Day weekend. Put a smile on someone's face. Look at Linda Hope. This is what it's all about. Jen, yes. way to go. Thank ET you. back right after this. What a feel-good Friday morning it's proving to be. We'll see you in two minutes.